So I'm here on the floor and I'm actually, I'm, I'm talking a little bit softly because I have a baby napping in the other room. <laughs> so it's my nap whisper. But I want to talk to you today about this little tool, this uh, hair marker. It's kind of a glorified butter knife, really. I mean, actually a butter knife would do the same thing. Yeah. But uh, why use a tool you have when you can buy a tool you do not have? So a hair marker is a quilt marking tool. You know, I think if you were also a bookbinder, there's probably a similar tool that bookbinders use to crease pages when they make signatures. So I've been told. Today we're gonna to use it to crease and mark our quilt. So I'm on the floor, um, I have a quilt sandwich. It's not basted. So right now I have my backing taped down. I have my batting laying on top and then I have my quilt top resting on top of that. So nothing is stuck together. Cause I like to do my quilt marking before I get a bunch of pins in there. I'm a pin baster, I'm not a spray baster. I hate spray based. I just think the overspray gets everywhere. It's bad for the environment. It's sticky. It's gross. I hate it. Ugh. Anyway, I pin base. And you don't want to be dodging a bunch of pins marking your quilt. Um, you know, it's just a headache, so you don't want to do it. So I'm going to show you just how easy it is to use this hair marking tool uh, to mark your quilt. And I'm working on, let's, let's take it down. Let's deep dive. Come on. Okay, here we are. So you can see I'm working on this, ooh, so pretty, uh, perennial quilt. It's a, it's a quilt pattern that's coming out in October 2019, whenever you're watching this video. Um, so I'm going to take my ruler. You can freehand, you can freehand curves, you can draw like a pencil, but just know that you have to give it some pressure because you're creasing. You're not actually marking. So I'm going to use my ruler. I'm going to line up the line of my ruler with a seam here and with adequate pressure I'm going to did you hear that so I'm gonna pull that away do you see that crease right there yeah I know you do let's get let's get a little closer whoa you see that crease right there see people ask me hey there you are hey people ask me okay so it's just creases it's not marks how permanent is that well, it's not permanent. I mean, it will wash out. That's kind of the beauty of it. That's why we like our hair markers. Sorry, <laughs> I'm trying to readjust my tripod. Oh, there you are. I'm trying to readjust my tripod so you can actually see me. Um, we love hair markers because they don't actually mark the quilt. They crease the quilt. So you're not gonna have these, uh, these stains, these quilt marking tools that, oh my gosh, they didn't come out. Um, but these creases shockingly do stay in. I mean, sometimes when you crease a bunch of stuff and you're like, oh, I don't really like that. It's kind of annoying how well the creases stay. You can, uh, you know, do one of these, scratch it. You can also um, use a toothbrush. People have told me that, I've never tried it. Um, but yeah, so I mean, I've, I've used the hair marker. I've made my creases. I've, I folded up my quilt really tightly. I threw it in a suitcase. I flew to Denver. I was, you know, tinkering around with it in my uh, hotel room. Uh, the whole time the creases stayed. So you'll be shocked. You will be shocked. Okay, so I'm just going to keep... Oh yeah, you can't see me. Back down. I'm just going to keep going with the flow. Right now I'm just doing... Uh, like I said, just kind of some wabi-sabi kind of lines on this wabi-sabi quilt. Before I was, I was working on a different part of my quilt. I can show you that. And I was doing half inch lines. And I think I'm going to hand quilt this. And so I was like, oh my goodness, Susie, you're going to kill yourself trying to hand quilt half inch lines. So I, knew, I, I backed away from that. That was kind of a crazy thing. I'll show you. I'll show you that what I was working on. Here we go. Come with me now. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, that was gonna be nuts. <laughs> nuts. But this this is this is much more realistic, you know. This is Susie with a plan, but not a crazy plan. So that's you know me living my best life. Anyway, um hair marker or butter knife. 
whichever you prefer.